And our favorite girl is here, Becky. Good morning. Good morning, favorite girl. Yeah, happy new year. This is the first <laughs> time yeah. we're doing a show together. Can so we happy. hug it all? Really? <laughs> you are a drama queen. <laughs> Mama V, good to see you in 2018. Yeah, definitely. I hope that uh, everything will change. Everything will change like, like how? Uh, hopefully I'll get married this year. Ah, okay. And yeah. yeah, so many things. I have so many things that I'll be doing this year. You have a boyfriend yet? We, well, it's <laughs> just... You have to clear <laughs> that off the way before It's just you. the feet of January, ah, so we're okay. still looking. Maybe I'll I'll find a boyfriend tonight at the Silver Star Tower as well. Ah, the, the 90s, 90s jam. Is happening. Ah. Maybe I'll get some 90s. I uh, uh -huh. you know guy to uh -huh. okay hook all, up right. With. all right i wish i wish you well with that thank you yeah but what, what do you have apart from the fact that you're looking for marriage this year, <laughs> i almost I, I almost forgot that i came to do <laughs> entertainment but let's let's talk about christabel aka you you remember christabel aka oh, who would forget her yeah if you probably don't remember the name she was the one who suddenly came out she has mm. a nice body by the way with some yeah. naked photos of her some of yeah. the skills but well she is saying that well she didn't regret putting up those photos really yes she decided to put uh, those photos on instagram because she uh, it's a way of appreciating her body that's contradictory basically. because i remember family members were worried yes. very close she, friends yeah and people she, said she she was mentally unstable yeah she said she's not crazy that's if that's what you're thinking she decided to put those photos out um her family members were not aware and so they had to come out can we hear her is she talking please. herself yes she is talking wow. herself and so we have Christopher right here my family didn't know those pictures were coming out so it surprised them as well and then um some some comments were out there so they just jumped and defended me but what were the pictures for was it for a project well, I've always wanted to do it. I wanted to do it, I think, in 2016 on my birthday, but a friend discouraged me. And then I took a chance and did it in 2017. And that's it. So it was for the public? Anyone who sees it. <laughs> and I had unfollowed everyone before the pic my pictures, you understand? So I just wanted to unfollow people so I can just post what I want, be myself without having to, you know, have influence from people I follow or people yeah follow. people who follow me so I just want that freedom to do what I would that's why I unfollowed people and you asked me why don't I want to follow people and I just kept it short and said I would rather follow God yes okay why what, I can't think far <laughs> honestly I, mean, I thought she didn't mean to but now that she's oh, she, put she she's put it. her voice on the photos she's brave first of all i it's, hope that it's 2018 we yeah, are all it opening is up 2018, i am getting married but this year yeah, so i get it and i like that very much okay. but i hope that she will never ever regret someday well because no. these photos will be there forever and now that she's 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 spoken people will now be bringing the photos out confidently well i hope that there won't be any female group any woman's advocates, blah, 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 <laughs> coming to say people can't share. People can share. Oh, I bet well, just before you go, we have to talk about the Kafa Awards. Kafa Awards, yeah. The even though it was held in Ghana, our arts didn't dominate Boris the stage. Boris Kujo was there to, you know, host the to show. To make up. Yeah. yeah. And yeah. Ifia was there to, you know, sing the national anthem, God bless our homeland, Ghana, yeah. all the time. And Kili was also there to perform, but the rest of them were all Nigerians. Wow. Mm. Yeah. I don't know why Ghanaians are We're not there though. yet. We're not super confident on an international stage yet, I guess. But our time is up. Uh, we've got to wrap up the show. Where's Roland? Uh, on behalf of Roland Walker <laughs> and the rest of our colleagues, we say goodbye. It's a Friday. Uh, so from Derek Echo, Sam, Fred, Dennis, uh, Jonah, all our colleagues here. And myself. And yourself. We say goodbye to you. Enjoy the weekend. We will see you, God willing, on Monday.